Hello YouTube and YouTubers. We are back to learn more about the Greeks in options and today's video is all about Vega. Now I always have to apologize at this point when I teach the class I often I teach derivatives class in London at King's College London and also at Queen Mary University and I, I always have to apologize to any confused looking Greek people who are sitting in my classroom scratching their heads and saying Patrick what is this? There's there's no Greek letter called Vega, and that is true. It it is not a letter of the Greek alphabet at all. Uh, the name Vega was probably adopted because the Greek letter Nu looks a lot like the Latin letter V, and Vega rhymes with the American pronunciation of Beta and Theta, and so uh, so it was decided to to name the Greek that relates to volatility as Vega rather than new and so that's that's uh, where we are so anyhow moving on from that uh, this is our sixth video in a series on the Greeks for options investors and if you want to watch uh, the others I'll put a link to a playlist uh, above and you should check that out so what is Vega? It measures the sensitivity of option prices to changes in the volatility of the underlying. And by the volatility of the underlying, I of course mean implied volatility, the expected volatility of the underlying over the life of the option. So Vega is the first derivative of the Black-Scholes options price taken with respect to volatility or sigma, um, which is of course standard deviation. Uh, one of the core Black-Scholes assumptions is that volatility stays constant over time and over the life of the option. In the real world, of course, that does not happen. And what Vega does is it shows us how options will change in value when the volatility expectation, the implied volatility that we're using in pricing them, uh, changes. So Vega is usually expressed as the change in an option's value as volatility rises or falls by 1%. All long options positions, both calls and puts, will gain value with rising volatility. So if you own options, if you own puts or own calls, if you bought options, you are long volatility and you will make money when uh, implied volatility increases and you will lose money when implied volatility falls. Your options will fall in value. So positive vega then means that an options position increases in value when the underlying stock volatility increases and that the options will fall in value when the underlying volatility decreases. It's often a little bit confusing at first that both puts and calls will increase in value with an increase in the underlying stock's volatility. But understanding this mechanism is probably the most important thing in understanding how options work at all. This relationship is further explained in the upcoming video I have on dynamic hedging. In fact, I would argue that that chapter of my book and equally the uh, hopefully the video that I'll, I'll shoot in a few days on this topic is probably the most important uh, concept for for options investors to understand so there'll be one video on dynamic hedging and another one on volatility arbitrage now vega is one of the most important greeks that an options trader monitors especially when markets are volatile it it matters a lot in fact if you go back Back to some of my videos on how we price options you can see how important uh, volatility is and how I argue that actually the price of option uh, of an option is really just down to its volatility well that and the strike price of the or the price of the underlying but the prices of options can be really sensitive to changes in volatility especially with certain options combinations things like straddles and strangles and so really you know 
a, a lot of what you have to think about when you're buying and selling options is this volatility and hopefully in the upcoming videos it'll become much more clear why why that really matters so much um, but anyhow that's it for this video please hit the like button do subscribe if you want to see more and even hit the bell button next to the subscribe button if you want to be notified uh, when my videos come out comment below if there are any questions you'd like to ask me or any topics that you think I should cover in these videos and um, they're all based on my book which is called trading and pricing financial derivatives and there's a link to that in the description below um, so have a great day and talk to you again soon bye